Okay, so what's new this month? We have a product from the new Thinking Anglers range. It's a re-release product, so it's been revamped. There's been a few bits changed on it, and it's a wonderful mat. It's not a mat that I've actually used myself, but that is because the mat I have has such great sentimental value to me. So I stick with that mat, and I will do for as long as possible. But should I lose that mat, touch wood, I don't. This is what I would have, and it's a it's a great bit of kit. These types of mats, they all derive from the old school CP mat that you would have seen Jamie with at the start. And um, yeah, they've just been developed over the years. So this is a thing in Angler's one, it's 69.99 and uh, I'll open it up. So the first thing to talk about is the waterproof base. You know, one of the big problems you'll get with a mat is them taking on water. So having that base layer of the mat completely waterproof, it's rubberized, it's, you know, not only is it strong, the water's not gonna get in, soak up into the foam and all that sort of stuff. So there's your rubberized mat, nice and tough, keep the water out. Turn it round here, there's a, there's a clip system. So they've put clips on either side and there's two eyelets on either side as well. And that holds the mat together, makes it easy just to transport around and also makes it a little bit more compact. Obviously when it's opened up, it's that size. So you can do that if you want, but if you want it a bit more compact and you want to transport it nice and easily, that's what this strap and this, uh, this clip system is there to do. Open the mat up, quite simply pop the old clips. So it's a nice big mat. And one thing you notice about it straight away is, is just how solid that is. I push my hands into that and um, you know, you, you really are not feeling the ground. Even if you give it a good whack, you ain't gonna get through to the floor. And that's obviously very important. So we can open this up. This is a new material, so they've, uh, they've improved the material, it's much thicker, more durable. And again, inside here, that's waterproof. Velcro around the side, seals it nicely when it's done. So obviously you can open this up, you put your fish on it. This is the bit that gets wet and dirty. Put the flat back over and uh, you're kind of protecting your stuff from getting all the, all the water and all your other bits. There's a kneeling flap at the front here. Obvious what that's for, you want to be kneeling on it. So if I spin that round, like so, mat's down there nicely, and that's where I would kneel. And again, that cover, when you've got a fish, the main reason for this cover, you know, should you need to cover the fish, you can do. It will velcro into place. And uh, it's safe and sound on that, you know, it can flap around as much as it wants. The padding's nice and thick, so it's not gonna to touch the floor, and um, it's got that lid on it as well. So two very important things to have on a mat. And a 69.99, great bit of kit. Carp care is very, very important, and everyone should have a good unhooking mat. So if you're in the market for one, have a look at this.